broads in the London. She's the Dolly in the family. Credit cards in the scams. Hitting the licks in the van. Hi guys, how's it going and welcome back to the channel. Today it's time to uh, get my team set for game week 25. Now as you can see, I've got one guy who is red carded. I don't think there's a return date on his injury yet. Nope. And I've got two guys who are yellow flagged. So we don't know if they're going to play or not. So, uh, the question is now, what do I do? Well, I'm going to get rid of Justin because we don't know when he's coming back. So... I'm going to get rid of Justin. That gives me 5.2 million in the bank. Now the offenders. See, there's two options really looking at this. You've got Taggart and you've got Dallas. See, Villa haven't got that the best of fixtures coming up, I'd argue. But Dallas, the figures aren't as good. But he has got a game, double game week in 25 and sometimes gets involved in the goal squad. So I'm going to go with Dallas and see how this goes. So I'm going to make that transfer now, confirm it. So that basically gives me, uh, oh, that's the wrong one. That gives me the uh, A option because now the uh, Justin who was red flagged is now out of my squad. So, who should I bring Dallas in for? So he's got double game week, so, you know. Uh, Dyer's got West Ham United away. Stones has got Arsenal away. Uh, wan has got Newcastle at home. And West Brom... Uh, West Brom. Burnley's got West Brom at home. So, I'll end, two fi I'll end fixtures, sorry. West Ham, a decent team. Arsenal, I see them over a defensive team and an attacking team. Newcastle a bit hit and miss, and West Brom, they're, all right, they're not doing that well, but they do score near enough every game. Um, I'm going to go with Dyer, just because I won't be surprised if West Ham score. And Dyer is not playing every game now for some reason, I'm not sure why, but he's not playing every game. Um, now, next choice is, do I keep Gundogan, or do I take him up for Son? Hmm. Do you know what? I think I will. I think I'll put Son on. And again, we don't know if Antonio's playing or not. So I think we'll go with Spurs there. Uh, you know, as a midfield option and attack option. I think that's probably best. Like, I'm not going to use. I'm not going to change my goalkeeper around because I think Guatier is more likely to keep a clean sheet than Leno is this week due to the playing. Obviously, Palace uh, away against Brighton and Man um, Arsenal at home against Manchester City. So I think that's the best I'm going to get team-wise this time round. Um, I'll just put, swap then two rounds. So the question is now, who am I going to select as my captain? Well, to me, it's a no-brainer. Bamford's got a double game week. Surely he'll get a goal, and at least a goal in, you know, one of them. It's like Southampton a bit and miss. Wolves, again, kind of it and miss. I, I don't see them scoring much Wolves, but the defence isn't bad when it wants to be. So I think we'll go there. Um, vice captain. I think we'll go Fernandez with uh, Newcastle uh, at home. You'd hope he'd get a goal, maybe two. So just in case, for whatever reason, Bamford misses both games. I doubt he will, but just in case, Fernandez as vice captain to uh, keep things safe. Now this game week starts at half past six this evening, so that, make sure you guys have got your squad ready by then. And the last game is on Tuesday, the twenty third of February, with Leeds at home against Southampton. Just let me click save team. The next game week after that starts on Saturday the 27th of February uh, with Manchester City at home against West Ham. Eh? What? Where's Man City now? Oh, Arsenal. I was getting confused then. But yes, Manchester City against West Ham starts it off and it will be finished on the Monday the 1st of March with Everton at home against Southampton. Oh, there's even a game on the BBC Sport there on the Saturday. I might uh, try and sneak that in to watch. 
Um, but yeah, looking at this, I think this is the best team we can manage for game week 25. I have still got my wild card to use at some stage. I'm thinking maybe game week 31 for that. But obviously I'll keep you guys posted on that. Um, I'm also hoping to get some more green owls this week. Because we didn't do that badly last week with 73 points. The average was... Excuse me. The average was 61. So I was pretty happy with how that went. But yeah, I think uh, we're going to finish this video here. Because I don't want to be talking forever. So if you guys enjoyed this, make sure you do hit the subscribe button and hit the bell. That way you'll be notified of any future videos and live streams. But until the next one, I'll see you later. Nice one, guys.